Woohoo everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kenzie Craig Michaels and what I was waving there is Jeffree Star's crown mirror, his hand mirror from the Bloodlust collection and I've already talked about the Bloodlust palette. We will be doing more reviews on the Bloodlust palette and how to achieve a full face look with this palette. It is absolutely stunning. It comes in velour and every time I look in this mirror I think to myself mirror mirror on the wall who's the prettiest boy off the mall. And I keep saying it, mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the prettiest boy off the mall. And dang, you know what? It keeps coming back saying the damn same thing. Jeffree Star is the prettiest boy on, on the block and in the mirror. So you know what? So far he is. But you know what? There's competition coming for you, Jeffree. That's all I gotta say. There's competition coming for you. Anyways, I'm just joking. Anyways, welcome to my channel. My name is Kenzie Craig Michaels. Today is Friday. And you know, today we are going to be talking about some products from Jeffree Star Cosmetics that are simple to and easy to apply. I've actually just applied um, black mascara and actually black eyeliner. I've actually done a little contouring here. I have nothing on my lips. Um, I've already applied my moisturizer, my foundation, etc. And wouldn't you like to know how to use three of these of the 24 karat gold palette? So we are going to be using the Sacrophagus, the King Tut, and the Dark Horse, which are the top three colors today on my lids to create a fantastic look. Um, basically a natural day look. So we're gonna start right away, and we're gonna take our shadow brush, and we're gonna dip into the King Tut, if you guys can see that there, the King Tut. And we're going to apply it right onto the lid. And as we're applying, like I said, there's no fallout on these shadows. I mentioned um, in my video yesterday there was on the black, but you know, black does fall off most shadows from most brands. I've actually never really seen a brand that it doesn't actually, you know, flake off and leaves drag underneath your uh, lash line. So always make sure that you're leaving a powder guard underneath that with a loose powder or just like a brush, a fan brush or a brush like I had mentioned before. So now we have King Tut on. We are now going to use our contour brush. That was just a flat eyeshadow brush. We're using our contour brush in Dark Horse, which is this color here. So we just used this one here to place the base color on the mobile eyelid. And these are absolutely fantastic colors, guys. They blend like you wouldn't believe. So I'm coming down like this. You can see the darker color, dark horse, being applied. I'm gonna do swirl and swirly motions. And this is just like a nice natural day look, something that you can do. And you know what? You know, feel confident that you're just going to your job, your business job, and not be like, oh my gosh, you know, I have so much makeup on. Now, if you are going to your business job, I would minimize the eyeliner on the bottom of the um, eye, and I would not rim the inner tear ducts as well. Unless, you know what, that's your thing, and you know what, all the power to you. So, and that being said, we have that placed. And just go with the crease, the natural crease of your eye. You know, people make it so, so compl um, complicated on how to apply a crease color, and it's just swirling motions, you know, back and forth, and then coming down briefly just onto the uh, mobile eyelid. All right, well, that is so simple. Now we're going to use a double-sided brush. This is actually from Smashbox Cosmetics, but we're going to use um, the Sacrophagus, which is the lighter color, as a brow color and as a highlighter. Just tapping the excess off there and going, ooh, girls, look at the color, look at the color. It is so, so amazing. Coming right into the inner corner of the eye. And of course, we're going to blend all this too at a 45 degree angle. So it doesn't look like, whoa. Girlfriend just put three colors in her eyes and didn't do anything. And you know, that will accent right in there as well. So we're gonna do the other eye on the brow bone as well. And I get so excited about shadow pigment. It's like truly, truly amazing. Ooh, here it comes again. Into the inner corner of the eye and up. And you know what, if this, you know, does, you know, have a little bit of a shimmer to it, that's okay because we're opening up the eye with that. See how my eye is opening up? 
and we can extend it slightly as well. We're gonna extend it right down to where your brow tail stops. So three colors, natural day look, black mascara for blue eyes. You can wear it also with green eyes, brown eyes. If you had purple eyes, you could wear it with purple eyes as well. Not many people have purple eyes unless you're wearing contacts that are colored. I'm just joking. Anyways, this is the Jeffree Star Pro Skin Frost Pro Palette in 24 karat. So, how amazing is that? So I've already applied onto this left cheek, if you guys can see here, the Jeffree Star Frost, the Skin Frost in So Effing Gold. So I'll just put a little bit more on here so you guys can see. And then I'm gonna do the other side as well. And see the luminosity down the bridge of the nose. And this is a great day highlighter, so effing gold. And it's woo, so effing gold. I just love it. Now from the Blood Lust collection came the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Queen Biatch, which is all your mini lip products. Isn't that cool? I just love this especially since I can just look at the colors and decide which color I want to put on for that day. So let's see, we are actually going to apply today. We're going to apply, we already applied I'm Vulgar before. So today we're going to apply, let's see, there's I'm Royalty, Virginity, um, Clout, and Berries on Ice. I think Berries on Ice would be a nice shade to apply. So let's apply that. And this is the Queen Bianche. So everybody better work it. So let's apply that. And it's so, so cute. It comes in pink. It comes out like that. There's nothing on my lips. And we're just going to apply it gently. Oh, look at that color. So this would be a great color, ladies, to wear with black with gray as well. Make sure that you exfoliate your lips on a regular basis like I had spoke about before. Um, and that being said, this is a beautiful color to wear with black, gray outfits, and dark navy colors as well. And it's super, super, super silky on the lips. It's not drying and it's a stain. So you can be um, assured that it's gonna stay on for a long period of time. So, I want to let everybody know about my secret giveaway. So, for the next 10 subscribers that subscribe to my channel, it is a contest for a giveaway of Jeffree Star's Blueberry Raspberry Scrub. And it's a sugar scrub that exploits the dead skin off your lips. So all you have to do to be entered into the contest, there'll be one winner for the next 10 subscribers, is you need to leave a comment, give the video a like, and leave a comment as to why you love Jeffree Star Cosmetics. If you've used Jeffree Star Cosmetics, what is his mantra? What does he believe in? How did he get started? You know, why did he start his cosmetic line? And you know, why do you think he's an icon in the fashion industry? So I'll have myself and I'll have another gay fabulous person looking at the comments as well so that I'm not biased to any of the comments to pick the winner. And I will personally ship it to you as well with some other goodies in the that you may find interesting. So, thank you so much for joining me. I'm Kenzie Craig Michaels doing the Jeffree Star Explosion review today. Have a great Friday. I will see you tomorrow. Cheers, everyone. And make sure, tick tock, tick tock, time's a ticking. Make sure you do that day look with Jeffree Star Cosmetics. Woohoo!